Okay then, so I've opened up an existing file, which has been saved previously. And I've got this file, and suppose I want to change the yellow in here to another color then. So let's change the yellow, which is this color here. If you didn't know what color it was, you could just sample it. Uh, like so, of course. And that tells you what color it is. And then you can just put that on the bar here, and then you can select it. So that's selected here as the main color. And suppose you want to replace that by white then. So normally you'd be able to go in if it was a new file, right click on your mouse and just move it over. And I'm holding down the right click on the mouse while moving uh, the mouse itself and it's not changing the color. So that's not going to do it with an existing file. It, I think it works with a new file to do that approach. So what you have to do is control A, control C. So I've copied the pre uh, existing image and then control V and then click into the page and I've overlaid a copy of the, the identical image onto itself and now this is as if it's a new file so to speak so if when I go to the eraser now and I right click and I can do to make the eraser bigger to make my life easier I just do control plus to make it as large as I wish and then I can just run it over like so so that should work and it's a much easier way than creating a new MS Paint file, pasting it in there, and then copying it and transferring it. You can do it in one fell soup in this simple shortcut method. So to change the white to a black, for example, if we go here and we select white as the main color, uh, let's change it to red, and then you can change that white that was existing color. Right click again, move your mouse over the colors, and you can change it to red. So it's a nice easy way. So don't forget, you make a co copy, Control A, you do Control C, you see so you select all, you copy the image and then you do a control V and that over pastes the existing file and then you can save it. So that's how you get around the problem with replacing one color, color with another in MS Paint and it's a shortcut around method.